From Tampa Bay Streaming News Source, brought to you by AlertTodayFlorida.com, this is ABC Action News. Hello, I'm Wendy Ryan. Dennis has Florida's most accurate forecast in just a moment. But first, here are your ABC Action News Now headlines. A woman is dead after being hit by a garbage truck on Davis Islands. Marsha Rivers was just feet away from where she lives when it happened on Tuesday morning. Investigators are questioning the truck driver but have not filed any charges. Officials are now calling a large depression a sinkhole in Pasco County. The 15 by 15 foot hole opened up between two mobile homes on Monday. People living nearby have been told to leave their homes as a precaution. The highest court in the land rules in favor of President Donald Trump's travel ban. It blocks people from coming to the United States from several mostly Muslim countries. But some critics are calling the five to four decision un-American. And now here's Dennis with Florida's most accurate forecast. Dennis. How you doing everybody? Tracking more storms winding down in the late evening and then by midnight skies clear as we wake up first thing in the morning on Wednesday. Look for a mixture of clouds and sunshine. It will be sauna like with temperatures in the upper 70s to low 80s. Dry for the most part, although I do think some showers begin to develop late morning, early afternoon right along the coastline. But with this pattern change reverting to what we had last week, it means the heaviest storms will be across our interior counties. And that's not just Wednesday. That's right through the early weekend. All right, thanks, Dennis. And don't forget, you can get news updates all day long on our favorite streaming device. And remember to download our free ABC Action News app. This ABC Action News Brief was brought to you by AlertFloridaToday.com. Pedestrians always use the crosswalk and cross with the signal when crossing the street because safety doesn't happen by accident.